Welcome back to The Local Show, a service of Geddes Federal Savings and Loan and Safe Harbor Wills and Trusts. The Local Show, featuring conversations with business owners, employees, and local business leaders about their successes, challenges, and reasons for doing business right here in central New York. The Local Show, locally produced by Zoe Advertising. Now, here are your hosts, Tom and Steve. Rolling back into The Local Show. Thank you for joining us. It's Tom and Steve, the inventors of The Local show and you are the consumers of the local show and hopefully consumers of a lot of the businesses that we put on the radio and uh, different electronic devices big event coming around uh, so you know where you get your food from and that's called on farm fest and it's just around the corner steve uh tell them a little bit about who's participating september what's going on. 16th there's like a dozen farms or more there's a whole bunch of them got to go to the website yeah to and, really and find we've it. been talking to the onondaga grown folks here for for mm-hmm. several months on a com. Saturday the 16th what a fun event you get to visit some farms yeah and then do some things and if you got kids or don't have kids do you like looking at when you go to the fair do you look at the cows Tom or you oh, like, of I course I do yeah what's the well, it's because a, I well it's interesting and and I can talk cow okay you, you want to see yeah you want to hear move, okay, move right. ahead here we go yeah here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Tom, You're very accurate, huh? Tom, <laughs> that 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 was more impressive than, yes. than anything you've you ever done. You didn't think I could do that? I got skills. Oh, that no. much I do have. Yes. No, no, I can. You know, I I can do a moose. Did you know that? <laughs> yes, you did know that. Yeah, well, well, people... Thank you, Tom. I really appreciate it. Yes. There, uh, that would be Bullwinkle. Yes, Bullwinkle yes. moose. Yes, <laughs> so, <laughs> very nice. Good job. Who's here, Tom? <laughs> Good golly, uh, Charlie Van Patten is here. He's the owner of Mattress Makers. Thank you for joining us, Charlie. <laughs> Good morning. And, <laughs> Any impersonations you want to do? Yeah, right. I didn't realize this was a comedy right. show. <laughs> oh, it's a variety show, all right. Uh, Char- Charlie can do a great impression of a mattress. There you go. Just, I absolutely you, can. Oh, you just got to lay there, right? <laughs> right. <laughs> Mattressmakerssyracuse.com. That's the website. So uh, go ahead, Charlie, and um, tell us all about you. All right. What do you got going Matt- this weekend, huh? Well, we got a big sale going on. You know, we got to support the the holidays and give my guys a Monday off so they can relax and come back and make lots of nice mattresses. Yes. So you mean uh, I, I don't have to go to the fair and lay, lay on a mattress? <laughs> Sorry to our friends at the fair. But I have to go oh. lay, lay on a mattress that's here today and, oh, let me think, gone tomorrow. <laughs> right. <laughs> Boy, that is a mistake. <laughs> I, I don't know why, you know, and, and I, I don't want to disparage anybody at the fair, but why would you buy a mattress at a, at a state fair? Well, it's a it's a That's captive audience. On. You're going along and, and imagine that your mattress sucks, and you're yeah. thinking, oh, I hear all these coming around. Well, lay, you lay down on it, and suddenly you're like, well, this is better than, I don't know, the bed of nails I'm laying on. So you... You, you, you have but how do you even get it or anything? Because oh, they, they, they pull oh, up they stakes say, and they're gone. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, that's why you know this is a local show. Let's right. buy local, <laughs> and you know if you go to Mattress Maker, one purchase you can buy local three times. You're buying from a local retailer. All oh, right, right. You're buying from a local manufacturer. And you're supporting supporting your local pocketbook personally because right. you're saving a lot of money. Yeah, you know, you and the qualities there. Some people are like, well, I want to buy a national brand. I know, uh, Char- Tom, uh, Charlie, don't listen. Charlie has a <laughs> habit. You know what it is, Tom? What's that habit? He cuts mattresses in half. He gets mattresses, oh, right. and, he, <laughs> and he cuts them up. He he's like, analyzes he's like, yeah. he, he's like, he does autopsies on old mattresses, and <laughs> and and the the national ones and some of the cheaper ones and whatnot, but uh, Char- am I wrong, Charlie? No, the guys laugh because every time the truck gets back, I open the door. Okay, what do you got? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The mattress corner. Corner, uh, corner. <laughs> and I do. Oh, it's a baffling, you know. I mean, talk about supporting local. A lot of imported mattresses too. Mm-hmm. From, I'll give you an example. In China, at one point, ninety-five percent of the imports are coming from China. Right. And in 2018... Now they come from South America. Okay, another, oh, another topic. Indonesia. Okay, Indonesia. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they do. They, yeah. I mean, in 2018, we got a tariff against them, and then all they did is jump over to Vietnam, Cambodia, and Laos. Right. But to give you an example how bad the import is on us because they're using cheap labor, government support, can you believe 800 to 1,800% tariff? That's a huge tariff. Wow. That's how yeah. bad the worst... They were sending yeah. in. I was, yeah, that, that's that's amazing to me. And I was having a conversation with someone in the last week, 
and they were talking mattresses. So I always perk up because, of course, Charlie's a friend of the show. Yeah. Um, and the the um, the fact that they're not made here. Yours are made here. Yours are the only ones made here. Ours but, are made here, but, and raw materials are su- supply sourced locally. Yeah, but the the um, um, I know you don't have to pay people to lay on your mattresses. People will come and 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 partake. But I I just. Do you know, Tom, when you didn't know anything about a topic and now you feel like, you know, that's how I feel like mattresses. Now that we're, we're <laughs> right. you know. now you're an expert. <laughs> well, I don't know, but I, I don't know why. Um, and just to mention, I know you, you mentioned earlier the, this weekend, uh, the mattress makers across from our friends at Fleet Feet behind Henry Wilson Jewelers. Right. Go and lay down, talk to talk to Carol or Jean or Charlie, whoever's there. And then the Chick-fil-A in Cicero. North Syracuse. Yeah, Cicero, Cicero right. yeah. But the one on Bridge Street, you see the factory. Yeah, sure. Absolutely. And I, I, every time I'm there, I, I wander a little bit because I find things interesting. <laughs> and while I'm back, I'm like, hey, what are you doing? I'm looking. You're welcome to come in and see what we've got. It's like the old story about uh, the competition telling people, well, you don't know what you're getting. Well, the customers is, I know exactly what I'm getting. I toured the factory. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, watching it be uh, put together. And, uh, you know, usually your your mattresses have higher quality um, uh, product in stuff. it. Stuff. Right. <laughs> yeah, stuff in it. Yeah, yeah right. <laughs> then the, some of the brand names, and they're typically half the cost. And now you have this Labor Day sale, so it would be safe to say that people could get some tremendous prices on a mattress. Oh, fantastic time to buy. Yeah, yeah. definitely time to buy. I mean, you know, it uh, amazes me. Like, you know, farms used to... You talk about farm days. Yeah. Cost, a farmer would have 300 cows. He was okay, you know. Now he's got to have 4,000 cows. Yeah. Same thing with mattresses. Traditionally, a mattress factory made 300 mattresses back oh, no in the kidding. day <laughs> when I started. Today, they're built for four, five, six, and 7,000 mattresses. Wow. Where you get back to the, you're mentioning the cost. You know, they save a penny. They save a dollar. That adds up when you're doing 4000 a day. $4,000 a day mm-hmm. is a lot of money. We're not looking at that. We're looking at the you best. You mean 4000 mattresses a day? Four thousand. Yes. Yeah, yeah, right. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just want to make sure. Car- we- Car- and, uh, Carol over there, she yes. came up to Mom's birthday party. Yeah. On Sunday. Yes, she was, yes, she, she was she's so it. sweet. And she um, yes. she just loves to help people. There's right. I, I don't know how she sells anything because she's not pushy. I don't know why. I mean, she's, right. there's, it's not, you, um, and I shared the story before. I went to a mattress store years ago, and yeah. they, they basically locked the door and didn't want me to leave. <laughs> this is before we knew you guys. Yeah. Uh, the closer ago. you got to that door, the lower the price went, too. Well, yeah. uh, you know. Um, there's a great part, if you've ever seen the, um, the movie The Internship. With Vince Vaughn, you know, uh, real, real funny where they get job internships yeah, at yeah, Google. Yeah. Well, he's working in a mattress store, uh, and Will Ferrell is like the manager. Okay. And and it's really funny because they show how pushy they are, and it kind of typifies that whole uh, yes, scene. Yes, I've seen you know? that. Yeah, that, that I really love funny. that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, no, it's it's. Uh, it's you don't get that at mattress but, makers. Nah, but Tom, you're right. If uh, if you if you want to get a mattress, um, hey, you got the time. Wander over to, to mattress makers. Um, I know you're not giving away any 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 special prizes. You're, you sell mattresses at half price. That's right. <laughs> no, yeah, you're, you're not going to get any uh, no free TV. None of that stuff that you right. end up paying for. So um, we <laughs> we just love uh, having you on, Charlie. Well, Excellent. Thank you. All right, Charlie. Uh, good, good job, and uh, we'll send people over your way. Charlie Van Patten is the owner of Mattress Makers. Go visit him and his staff. We're going to kick off our number two of the local show with conversations with Troy Waffner. He's the CEO of the SPCA. Michael Johnson is the owner of Pro Snow Removal. And Lou Greco from the Uncle Louie Variety Show. And Jason Odom is the assistant manager at the Spaghetti Warehouse. They'll all be in our number two. Great conversations, riveting as a matter of fact, coming up in hour number two of the local show, which starts really soon.